that was a battle. And uh, I give a ton of credit to uh, Hartford and Coach Gallagher. I mean, they didn't give up an inch. They played great basketball. That's one of those games that you say, you know, it's a shame somebody has to win or lose because both teams competed so hard and gave everything they had in that, uh, in that 40 minutes. And I know how that other side is. I know how it feels. It's, it's not the best feeling. I'm really proud of these guys because when things went against us, they kept a great attitude. They kept grinding, kept playing, and they didn't, they didn't get down. They didn't hang their heads once. Uh, and that sh showed our growth and maturity. I'm really proud of them. Okay, questions for the student athletes and guys. Just pull the mic stands right up to you. Uh, Matt, every, uh, it seemed like every time out when there was uh, some tussle after the, the play, uh, you would go over to whichever player was involved in and say something to uh, any particular you got you said to the players. Uh, I was just like, I was just trying to keep everybody poised and, uh, and calm and uh, just, you know, we focus on even things that weren't going our way or if we miss an assignment on defense or if we miss a jump shot or turn the ball over uh, to keep a good attitude and just keep playing and just and just uh, stay poised out there because if you lose your head in a game like that, uh, it's hard to get back into the game. So you just want to stay calm. And uh, even if things aren't going your way, I was just trying to make sure that we're all just going after the next play. Pat, coming into the weekend, you talked a lot about defensive rebounding, but you posted nine points yesterday, 10 points today, six of six from the free throw line. It seemed that like, you were a lot more aggressive this weekend. Uh, well, yeah, it's just, um. It's this time of the year, I guess it brings the best out of us. And, um, yeah, like I said, defending and rebounding was a big key for us. And I feel like that's what got it done tonight. Just We just kept grinding, and those are our principles, man. We just stick to that. That's our foundation, and I feel like that's going to get it done the rest of the way, too. Now, let's see different pattern, Matt. How does it feel after last year sitting out because of transfer regulations? How does it feel now to play a big part in bringing a team to the title game? Uh, it feels great, man. It's, um, like we said, we, we like to say it a lot. We don't get these chances back. and. I feel like we're taking advantage of it. And uh, yeah, I mean, sitting out, we uh, we learned from uh, some great seniors. We had some great senior leadership last year, and uh, those guys really paved the way for us. So it's nice to kind of uh, come back here and, and try to do the same things that they had already accomplished, uh, you know. So. John, I know you don't particularly like reflecting, but the championship game is NBU. You get to play on Commonwealth Avenue again. Uh, any thoughts about that, about potentially getting a bit to the tournament? Uh, it's great uh, just to get the opportunity. You know, it was a tough game, tough two games, tough two days. And uh, I'm just grateful that we got the opportunity to pull it out tonight. Guys, what does it mean um, after uh, a road tournament and then really playing Harvard on their home floor? Uh, uh, tonight, what does it mean to be able to go back home now um, for the championship game, especially after some struggles on the road earlier this season? Um, I'm glad we got to play in a tough environment, and um, it's just I feel like it brings the best out of us. We come a, we come a lot closer on the road, and it um it just prepares us for the worst situations. And I feel like we came through tonight, and we just grinded, and it was a it was a really tough situation. The crowd was really into it. Those guys played with unbelievable passion the whole game, man. It's um it's great to play in these environments, man. It, it shows us what we're really made of. Yeah, I would just say, you know, going home, we're just looking forward to playing our next game, whether it be at home or away. Uh, we're just looking forward to continue to get better and work hard and practice. And if it was at home, our place or away, you know, we're just excited to be in the, in the championship game. John, what can you lend to the, the rest of them? You're the, kind of the old man. You played in a championship game on national television last year. Now you're going home to do it. Um, I, I really don't have to lend anything. They, they, they've been through it. They were at practice all last year, too. So they know what it's all about. And now it's just we practice for it every, every day. So this is, this, is, this is what we do, all, all the running, all the getting up in the morning, all everything that we do, this is what it's all for. So. Uh, I really don't have to say anything. They already know, and uh, hopefully we can show it on Saturday. John, what, what do you tell them? What, what can they expect just from, from your experience? What is it that is so different? Uh, I, I never had a championship game at home, so I know at Vermont it was crazy. But uh, at home, I'm not sure. So 
uh, I, I expect it to be great. To any of you guys, I, I'm not sure if you, you know about this, but the last time that you actually went to the NCAA tournament, they were a two seed and they knocked off Hartford in the semifinals. Not sure if you guys are aware of the, the few history of that or if you think anything of that, but. <laughs> Any other questions for student athletes? Thanks a lot. Oops, excuse me. Matt, can you, Matt, can you just talk about those two three pointers? I don't know if, if I missed that if you, before I came in, but uh, huge shots. So, just what was going through your mind? Uh, you know, coach, uh, all through the game, was was telling me that I needed to shoot. So, you know, I was just I was looking for an opening, trying to get my shot off. And uh, you know, DJ did a great job of penetrating and looking for me on the on the break. And uh, I was able to get a little bit of space. And I just wanted to do what Coach told me to do is just shoot with a lot of confidence. And uh, so that's what I tried to do on those two shots. Any other questions for the student athletes? Thanks a lot, guys.